Dramatic body cam footage revealing the moments officers opened fire on a man who had killed his wife and shot an Oregon state trooper. This is Coin 6 News at 11 o'clock. I'm Jennifer Hoff. I'm Jeff Gianola, and tonight we get a first-hand look at how police responded when trooper Nick Cedarberg is shot by a murder suspect on the run. Our Andrew Dimbert joins us live with more on this video. Andrew? Yeah, Jennifer, Jeff, uh, Christmas night, James Tilka was on the run from police for murdering his wife in cold blood. Trooper Nick Cedarberg was the first to catch up to Tilka on a dark, dead-end street in Sherwood. 90 seconds later, code zero, officer down. Now, we must warn that the footage you're about to see may be disturbing for some. Buddy. Okay. Someone got the woods? I got the woods. Okay, I'm shaking yeah, off. I'm going to drag him I got off. the woods. Hey, he's right Stand here. there! Right there. Stand right there. there! Christmas night, 2016. Where's the gun? Where's the gun? Body cam footage the capturing the moment five police officers shot James Tilka on the run for murdering his estranged wife earlier that night. Now this, just minutes after Trooper Nick Cedarberg was shot by Tilka, laying on the ground, fighting for his life. Go to my vehicle, get my trauma kit. Today, the Washington County District Attorney's Office releasing the body cam footage from one of those officers, concluding the shooting was justified. It seemed like it went on forever. That fateful Christmas night ended right in front of Carol Sumner's home. Oh, it was like a war zone. It, it was crazy. Carol hasn't seen the video. She doesn't want to relive the horror. And I've still got it in my head and what we heard and all the bright lights flashing. So it's still stuck in my head. According to the investigation, after Cedarburg was shot, the five responding officers quickly formed a 360 maneuver to cover each other, likely saving more lives. Oh my gosh, I've never seen so many police officers and they were in a big circle. Tilka was shot 21 times, including one self-inflicted gunshot wound. All officers believed Tilka was trying to shoot and possibly kill them. And investigators say at the time Tilka was shot, all officers on scene knew that he had just committed murder, was armed, and had just shot Nick Cedarberg. As we've reported several times, Cedarberg survived and was just released from the hospital earlier this month. Andrew Dimbert reporting for Coin 6 News. Jennifer, and you, see, and you see those seconds, Andrew, in a life and death situation mm -hmm. like that and the decisions that have to be made.